Good morning. <coughs> what day is it? <coughs> Better go check. <sighs> it, it's Easter? Oh god. No, 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 no. Oh no, Bonnie's gonna be in here any minute. Uh, uh. You guys wanna go to Dunkin' Donuts later? <laughs> Guys, abandon ship! Code red! Code red! Ah, Freddy, what's your problem, dude? Don't you get it, Springtrap? It's Easter. Ah, okay, I don't get it. Springtrap, allow me to put into perspective for you. Every year, Bonnie does a giant, and I mean giant surprise or something dumb for Easter. Eventually, we get tired of it. Like right now, we're tired of it. We don't want any more Easter surprises. I'm tired of looking for eggs. You wanna know where I found one? In my room. Now, I don't know when he placed that egg in there, but I'll tell you, it ain't the little plastic eggs you get at the dollar store. It was an actual egg he painted. That thing went rotten under my bed. Yeah, um... Yeah, I don't like talking about that, uh, that whole Easter egg scenario, because I remember the same year I, uh, Carl went missing, and then I figured out that, uh, Bonnie used some of his frosting to make, well, uh, used some of his frosting to paint some of those Easter eggs. Is that why Carl's not in videos? Huh? Uh, d d anyways, uh, yeah. Huh. Well, the point is, we don't need Bonnie causing any more problems this year. Do you guys think I had something to add? Well, I mean, kind of. We all kind of gave our reason on why we don't like Easter. What about you? Well, not really. I mean, most of the Easters between me and Bonnie are pretty tame. I mean, usually just gives me, like, some of those chocolate pirate coins. They're pretty cool. Now he never really does anything to me. Wow. That makes no sense. Yeah, I mean, are you guys like best friends or something? No, I think he just knows that um, if he decides to mess with me, he's going to catch the back of my hand. Yeah, yeah, that's fair, that's fair. Oh God, I think that's him. Hey guys. Oh dear God. Yeah. Alright guys, I'm gonna be honest with you. <sighs> I have nothing planned for Easter. Uh, really? Nothing? I don't buy it. Yeah, me neither. Something fishy's going on here. No, I really have nothing. So, <sighs> what are we gonna do today? Well, since you have nothing planned, uh, now we have nothing to do. Yeah, kind of our whole plan for Easter was gonna be like, trying to stop you from doing anything crazy. Yeah, but now that we know that you're not gonna do anything, we really have nothing to do. Wee! Oh, not you again. Oh hey, it's the kid that almost ruined the pizzeria. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. Uh, anyways, I heard that you guys have nothing to do for Easter. So, I'm going to give you guys something to do. And what would that be? Well, I've heard tale of this secret portal that leads to an Easter dimension. An Easter dimension. I actually don't mind the idea of that. That actually sounds kind of cool. Yeah, and basically, you guys are going to get to go to this Easter dimension where there's all kinds of candy. It'll be like that one movie. Uh, what, what was it called? The, the guy, the, the kid named Charlie, and I went to the chocolate factory. Charlie and the chocolate factory. Yeah, yeah, that one, that one. It'll be just like that. That uh, actually doesn't sound too bad. I mean, we can eat candy and stuff, go on like maybe an Easter egg hunt or something, that's cool. Yeah, I actually like this idea. All right, so when can we go? Um, I'll give you guys some directions. Uh, I'll hand you guys a phone. It should have the directions on the Google Maps. So yeah. 
All right, so there's the phone. It's got the Google Map directions. Just follow them, and you'll find your way. All right, well, thanks, kid. Uh, we never caught your name last time. Well, my name is Biscuit. You say what now? L like, like, Biscuit, but quit? Biscuit? Yeah, exactly. Am I sure I'm hearing that right? Yep. Anyways, I'll catch you guys later. Uh, Alright, well, I guess this gives us something to do. Well, let's go, guys. Right behind you. Yeah, this actually doesn't sound too bad. I like this idea. Hmm. Wait up for me. Alright, guys. Time to go into the portal. See what that kid was talking about. Alright, Freddy. Let's go. Alright, I'll go in first. <laughs> well, I guess I'll go in too. <laughs> What do you say the lot of us go in? All three of us. Sounds good. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Ooh. Ugh. Ugh. Well, hi there. Ah, what the frick? Is that my strange cousin? They look like Spring Bonnie. Where's Spring Bonnie even been these past few days? Uh, guys, I think we're missing the more important point. Who are you? Yeah, I agree with Golden Freddy here. This is strange. Well, hi there, everybody. My name's Easter Bonnie, and welcome to the Candy Dimension. Wow, so that kid was not actually insane. Surprises the heck out of me. Well, here in the Candy Dimension, we have plenty of things to pique your interest. So, follow me. I'll give you guys a tour. No harm in it. Oh, couldn't hurt. I mean, we're here for a while. It's Easter after all. Come on, guys. All right, Freddy. Come on, guys. Well, to start off, here we have the taffy trees. These are honestly one of the best food sources around. And they produce, this time of year, the best taffy in the world, the pink ones. Well, as nice as that sounds, how would one get up there? Yeah, I mean, that's a really tall tree. Well, that's pretty simple. Watch this. You see, all you have to do is and whee! Oh my god, are you okay? I think he died trying to get that taffy. Okay, so who wants to try it? Uh, I'll try it. But I'll warn you, I've never really been much of a candy guy. Well, don't worry, I'm sure this will make you change your mind. Well, down the hatch. Mmm, mmm. Well, a little chewy. Uh, I'm not really seeing the... <gasps> it's bringing back childlike wonders I never knew I once had. That's the magic of the taffy here. Okay, now this place is cool. Yep, and that's only the first part. Okay, well, what's next? Ah, yes. For the next part of the tour, you're going to want to follow me. I have never seen Springtrap with so much energy. Me neither. This is weird. It's best not to think about it. Anyways, come on, guys. Let's go. All right. The next part of the tour is the candy inspection room. Might I start out by saying, has anybody got a sweet tooth? Oh, oh, I do. I do. Ah, well, why don't you eat some grass? You say one well, now. No, I'm serious. Try it. It's candy grass. Mainly made of sugar. It's pretty good. Well, I guess. Mm. Wow, that's really sweet. Yep, and that's part of the candy inspection room. That's actually part of most of this world. Most of it's sweet and made of candy. The point of the candy inspection room, everybody, is to make sure that all the candies come out great for Easter. Make sure that there's no problems, make sure that there's no melted chocolate, no stale candy, no bad candy, because if we have rotten candy, no one's gonna wanna eat any candy for Easter. Ah, and here come two of my three best friends who are, well, they work here at the candy inspection room. Everybody, I'd like you to meet Chocolate Bonnie and Chocolate Freddy. Say hi, guys. What's up, guys? Hey, guys. Real nice to meet you. Well, we're going to let them show a little bit of their job here. What happens here is a candy falls from the ceiling, and they need to judge if it's gone good or bad. Chocolate Chica was assigned to drop the candy down. Chocolate Chica, first piece of candy, please. And now, we watch them do their job. 
Eh. Stretchy. <laughs> Smells good. It's good candy. And now everybody, they're gonna go take that candy into a room where we manufacture and send out all of our candy to your world, your dimension. Hey, I'll be right back from sending in the candy. Alright, be back quick. Now everybody, while we wait on Chocolate Bonnie to get back, do you have any questions? Oh, I do, I do. Yes, Freddy. Well, uh, my question here is, um, does the candy come from different sorts of trees? Like, we know that that taffy comes from the taffy trees, but are there different trees for different candies, like chocolates and other types of stuff? Why that is a magnificent question, and it is a yes. There are many different trees and bushes and other plants that grow these different foods. These different candies and these different sweets that everybody eats on Easter once they've gotten the Easter eggs. Hey, I'm back. Ah, that's fantastic. Chocolate Chica, next piece of candy. Ooh, now you see everybody, this is a prime example of candy that's gone a little bit bad. <laughs> Uh, boss, we didn't really train for it uh, to do this kind of thing. Yeah, since when do we make living candies? Um, we, we don't. Uh, excuse me, who are you? <laughs> Get off of me! <laughs> um, sir, what do we do about that? Ah, uh, it should be fine. He's chocolate, he'll probably melt. Does that happen often? I'll be quite honest with you guys, no. We haven't really gotten a lot of living candy. In fact, we don't come across a lot of visitors. That's why it was pretty exciting to share this tour with you guys. You see, recently our business has been going a little bit under. A lot of people back in your guys' own worlds don't need us anymore. They make their own candy. They don't need us to make candy for them. And while our process comes and makes more delicious candy, they don't really care about how good it tastes, more about how quick it gets to them. And you see, candy can't really get to anybody quickly if, you know, it's grown on trees. Well, how much time roughly does it take for one of those, let's say, the taffies to grow? Well, for a fully ripe and delicious tasting taffy, it takes about a few months. M months? And spring drop ate one? Yep, yep, I did. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm really sorry about that. I didn't really mean to do that. I mean, uh, I mean, I kind of did because you kind of gave it to me, but uh, th th that's fine, I guess. And you know, we can't exactly give people pure sugar in the form of this grass. Well, you know, you guys should probably be getting home, huh? Well, I'll show you guys the way home, and uh, I really hope you guys had fun because I had fun showing you guys this tour. Yeah, we we had a lot of fun. What's that? Why is it so loud? Oh no, oh no, oh no. That melted thing. Wait, the melted thing? No, not that thing. What did it do? Quickly, everyone, follow me to the tree, the taffy trees. Okay. <laughs> oh no, it's eating the taffy. Boss, what do you want us to do? I'm not sure. This this hasn't happened before. It shouldn't happen. <laughs> Mr. Easter Bunny, look out! Huh? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Sir! Oh god, I can't walk. Wait, guys, look. Oh god, oh god, oh, wait, wait, what? <laughs> oh! Oh, I get it. He has a sweet tooth. He just wanted the candy in my pocket. Huh. Well, that makes sense. Yeah. Well, I gl I'm glad this ended well. Yeah. Now, where was I? Oh, yeah. I was taking you guys home. Follow me. Well, everybody, I guess this is our last time we're going to see you. You know, Easter Bunny, you should just come with us. Yeah, I mean, you did say that your business was going under. Plus, we have plenty of room where we live. Well, you do have a point. Well, boys, what do you say? I say it's a good idea to get out of here. We can find better jobs. Yeah, the high demand for candy isn't really all the range now. <coughs> yeah, we can get better candy now. Hmm. Well, I guess in this case, sure, Freddy. All right, well, I guess it's settled. Come on, everybody, we're going home. 
Alright, 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 yeah! And how much longer is he gonna be like this? Oh, well, the effects of the candy should wear off anytime soon. Alright, cool. Well, come on, Springtrap. And... Alright, boys. Time to go. Where's Chocolate Chica? Also, why did it turn dark? Oh, uh, Chocolate Chica's in the bag, and uh, it turned dark because... Remember, the day-night cycle here is a little bit different than in the regular dimension. Ah, yes, yes, yes. But but might I ask, why is the bag so big? Uh, well, you see, it's not just Chocolate Chica in there. There's like a couple other things in there. Like some extra candy, some other stuff, you know. Ah, yes, okay. Well, uh, go on in, boys. I've got to say my goodbyes. All right, you guys ready to go? Can't wait to see what it's like there. Uh-huh. All right, guys, let's go. First, in goes our bag. Yeah. All right, boys, I'm going first. Har. <laughs> Goodbye, Candy Dimension. I'll miss you. Maybe I'll come back. I hope this place goes well while I'm gone. Ugh. Well, welcome to our house. Huh, well, it's real snazzy. Thanks for letting us stay, Freddy. Glad to be out of there. No problem. It's nice to have you guys here. Well, we're gonna go get situated now. Well, guys, would you say that was a successful Easter? You know, Freddy, I think so. Wait, has anybody seen Springtrap? Come to think of it, haven't seen him. Ugh, sugar crash. That's kind of your fault. Yeah, but it's okay. I got this from the dimension. I think I'm gonna eat it. Oh god, Springtrap, no! 